Good morning, cultists. In our last episode, we ended things off after hunting down three dog who escaped from Fallout 3 to terrorize the people here with his obnoxious radio stuff. So now he is no more. Of course, he tried to go by the alias two dogs, but um, we knew better. We knew better. Addy, what do you need? Addy. Hey, Deacon, how can I help you? Uh, it's Boozer. Is he okay? He's, yeah, not well. He's not. He's not sick or anything. It's just, I don't know. Well, I told you that it was going to be a big adjustment. Do you have any drugs around here? Like antidepressants, something like that? No. Sorry. Okay. Wait. I heard about what happened. How we went after those guys who were killing those dogs. Yeah, and he nearly got us killed while doing it. Well, maybe that's your answer. Nearly getting us killed while doing it? Look, what does William love so much that he'd be willing to risk his own life? He doesn't need something to heal his body. He needs something to heal his soul. I got it. Thanks, Eddie. So what, what are we thinking? Do we get him a dog? I mean, we killed two dog earlier. If he was three dog, then uh, there'd be one dog left, right? Or is that is that not how it works? All right, well, <laughs> fine. Um, I guess there's not much else to do but go talk to Ricky about the transformer. Yeah, I guess we're trying to look for Optimus Prime. Who may have escaped from his own universe as well. A lot of people are escaping from their universes. I don't know how it's so easy for them to do. Maybe they uh, found a tear in the um, universe's butthole. You got what you need? Yeah, everything I could think of. Let's go. Oh, uh, you sound pretty excited. It's the candle, Deke. What? The old saying, it's better to light one candle than curse the darkness. We've spent the last two years doing a whole lot of cursing. We get the lights on at last leg, and that's lighting our first candle. Yeah, only one problem with that. And what's that, Deke? Lights attract all kinds of nasty bugs, and they make it way easier for him to find you. Hey, we're here. Shit! Swarmers. I was hoping it was gonna be clear. Nah, why would we have that kind of luck? If you wanted it clear, you could have at least let me know that you wanted it clear before we came here. Come on, Ricky. You know better than that. You could have, like, commissioned me. You could have, like, I don't know. Wow, he's making some predator noises. Nice. What are you trying to do? Could have sniffed my butt. That is privileged okay. information. Ass face. Oh, what's up? Crap what? Oh, she crapped herself. You know what, Ricky? Been there. Don't worry, I'm not gonna judge. It's all right. Just okay. Let me to sniff. Fix this thing. I gotta climb up there. <laughs> Have you done this before? Nope. But there's a first time for everything, right? Right. Okay, come on, boost me up. All right, ready? Uh-huh. One, two, three! If you fall, it ain't like I can catch you. Gee, thanks. I'll um, try to keep that in mind. Should we deal with the newts? Oh, my God. I guess the newts are here to deal with us. What the fuck? All right, you little piece of shit. Come at me. Yeah, you don't say. Oh my god. Try Got him. Little shit. All right, what else do you little shits want? Huh? Time to massacre these children. Yeah, give me more. Give me more babies. Give me more babies to. Massacre! Yeah! <laughs> Fantastic. There's one more. 
There's a few more. I can smell them. Little baby-faced assholes. Smeg off. All done. I'm coming down. Fantastic. Well, That was fun. Yeah, we're gonna have to come out and do this again sometime. Yeah, I'll talk to Schizo about getting some barbed wire around this. It'll keep the newts off. Yeah, sounds like the kind of shit job he likes to give me. <laughs> You'll live. Come on, I gotta check something else out. What, are you going for a swim again? Also, I need more scrap. Ricky, do you have more scrap? Can you get me some scrap, Ricky? Come on, Ricky. Just need a little bit. Just this one last time. Come on, Ricky. I know you're good for it. You know I'm good for it. What are you gonna do? Pee on that cedar sapling? That's what she's gonna do. What? What are you... Oh, I guess she was waiting for me. Alright, fine, fine. Looks like I don't get to watch Ricky pee on a cedar sapling today. Well, so, there goes my Friday. Lady? Okay, how the hell did... It's not hard to put two and two together, Deke. But you lost her at that refugee camp. Uh, the one north of Belknap. And in the last few weeks, we've seen Nero choppers in the air, and... You were hoping for what? A miracle? That she was with them somehow? Something like that. But she's not. No. I'm sorry. Look, it's not a big deal, so let's just drop it. Okay. Wait, I thought we were checking something else out. Wow. Word gets around. I'm almost ready. Power to the whole resort is routed through here. I pulled the breaker a week ago so it wouldn't short out. Okay. Ready when you are. All right. Let's listen up. Okay. Now, the past few months have been tough. Not going to deny that. We're low on food, medicine, hell. Pretty much everything. But we got one thing in spades. And without that, everything else is meaningless. That one thing is trust. Now, a while ago, we had some more drifters right into camp. Some of you said kick them out. We ain't got enough for ourselves. Some of you said we can't trust him. Tonight is proof of what I've been saying all along. Yeah. We yeah. need everyone. I mean everyone who is willing to be here, who is willing to work, who is willing to help us rebuild. Yeah. Now for the past couple of months, Ricky, has been doing just that. Job, she can't do it alone. She needs help. Tonight is going to happen because we welcomed a drifter into our camp. And we allowed him to earn our trust. Tonight, we take one more step out of the darkness. So the woman in the photo, that was her? That was my wife, yeah. Dumb question. I'm I'm sorry, Deke. No, yeah. Don't be. She's uh she's been dead a long time. Still, it can't be easy to get your hopes up like that, only to I, I don't know. I wish there was something I could do. Well, there is. What? Stop talking about it. Okay. Or you could get plastic surgery to look like her, and then you could fall in love with me, you know? Despite the fact that you're not into dudes, I think? I mean, maybe she could be into dudes too. 
Addie? Addie! Hey, the lights are up. I don't think she's here. Addie, you here? Okay, well, strip. Strip, strip what? Take your shirt off, sit on the table. Hey, look, it's nothing. Deacon, do you want an infection? Mm hmm. I may be an engineer, Deke, but that does not mean uh -huh, that I don't know how to treat a cut. Yeah, I never would have guessed the way that you were caressing those switches and circuits or whatever the hell you were doing. <laughs> All right, this <clears throat> might hurt just a little bit. Ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Really? No, I want to just wait for Addie to come back, just, huh? Shh. Hang on. There. It's done. Big baby. So I told you it was nothing. <laughs> yeah, you did. <clears throat> oh, wow. You really have been at war. Yeah, more than one. Shit, that's right. Where was this one? Afghanistan or the MC or after? I, uh, I don't remember. What about this one? Ricky, uh, I'm not sure that, uh, well, I heard that Addie doesn't really like, um, people messing around in her. Yeah, I, I heard that too. What about this one? Dick, I'm not married. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Why don't you come back tomorrow and see Addie and she's gonna tell you how great of a job I did. Ricky, um... Deke, it's, it's, it's fine. You're welcome. Hey, Deacon? <clears throat> Maybe one day, stop and light a candle. It can get pretty dark and cold out there. I knew it. I knew there was some tension between the two. I knew it all along. Nice. Uh, so all the other ones are... Okay, cool. Ah. Also, fucking schizo. What a creepy asshole. And this is one creepy asshole saying that to another creepy asshole. Unbelievable. Okay, so I guess we don't really. Oh, got a new skill. Oh, what do we want to invest in? Quick reload. Um, or I would like to get this, but that's gonna require a couple more points. So I do wonder if maybe I should invest in this and then eventually that, or maybe I should just go with quick reload. Not exactly. Hmm, you know what? Let's just go with Thorn in your side. Yeah, and then next we can get the um, thing to carry more stuff. Yeah, I think that'll be good. Because I don't find I'm like always like in a pinch for reloading. At least I don't think so. <laughs> Maybe I am, but I just don't realize it. Wow, it looks really blue. This is interesting. This is an interesting uh, daylight we got going. It's almost surreal. Like it's out of a painting or something. Maybe this is it. Maybe Deacon died in that little um, speech that uh, during that little Elk, speech that oh. Do you read me? Elk, I come in. Damn it! Someone go out and find him. Check the dig site. What? Oh God! Don't miss your shit. Oh, fuck. Damn wolves! Damn everything! 
Ah, shit. So, sorry, what's going on? Uh, Tucker needs help? Is that right? Or something about Al-Kai? Uh, she's getting in contact with Al-Qaeda. I see. Wait, do I actually have a mission? Wait, what? Didn't I just do that? I'm so confused. Yeah, Hattie. Check this out. One of my patients overheard us. They might know where you can find a healthy dog. Okay, I'm listening. There's a small resort south of Sherman's camp. A, a bunch of cabins in the woods. You know the one I mean? No. Okay, it's off Santium Highway. The same road you take to the old sawmill. I, uh, and Ricky said she rode with you over there to see the horde? Yeah. The day you guys were gone all day. To the dam. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, I know, I know what you mean. Deer crossing. Well, guess you don't have to be worried about traffic no more, do you? Uh... Is that directed at Addy? <laughs> a little weird to just interject that, but sure, Deacon, why not? Why not? All right, let's go find ourselves a uh, dog. See, I told you. So, three dog came into this universe, but somehow I guess he, during crossing over, uh, maybe split like a kind of fisher kind of thing, and then um, the fisher resulted in three dog becoming two dog. With one dog being separated and, um, I guess free to do whatever the hell it wants to do. Who's out there? Why was that noise? Uh. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Weird. That was a very viscerally close noise. Yet. What the fuck was that, Deacon? Do you not know how to slam through a door? Come on, man. What's wrong with you? Pooch, where are you? That's how you attract a dog. Say, come on, Pooch, where are you? It's the uh, secret to summoning dogs. Hmm. All right, I guess we'll go tussle with these assholes. I if I were a dog. Um. Probably inside of someone's butt. Because aren't dogs like always going after butts and crotches? I know that's what they do. I don't know if that's the dog's way of like subtly telling me that I have a really smelly crotch, but uh, dogs always seem to just love my crotch. Fuck you! Oh my god, this one asshole just matrixing all over, all over the place. What a douche. Uh, kerosene. I'm pretty sure I don't need it, but I'll check it nonetheless. Do I need kerosene? I don't. Think so. I can't seem to even like interact with it or even acknowledge its presence. Wait, I've been here before. Oh, this is on my way to um to clear out the uh, ambush camp. Yeah, I remember. Okay, could really do with some scrap right about now. Uh, see a lot of freakers over there, but thankfully there shouldn't be any uh, marauders or nothing. I'm hoping. What is that? What's out over yonder? A rag! I don't need nor want a rag. Bastards. Can I open this? It's not gonna open. It's not gonna open? Okay. Sure. Hmm. Have I been into this house before? Why is that? I can hear him. It's got to be close. There he is. Ah, Doggo, are you in there? I hear a doggo. Oh, making such cute noises. Find bait to lure the dog out. Like aniseed balls? Because aniseed is kind of like um, what's it? Catnip for dogs, right? Not even even sure what aniseed is. Is that uh, somehow related to uh, star anise? Is that what it is? Star anise balls, the testicles of star anise, the flower. What the fuck? What does tracking a freaker have anything to do to do with anything? 
Oh. Teeth marks. Yeah, this has been chewed on. Oh, I see. So it's not food for the dog, but rather stuff that the dog likes. Oh, or no, it is box of dog treats, I guess. What happened to your face? Was it eaten? By the dog? Oh shit. Totally was eaten by the dog. Good grief. Do I want a face eating murderous dog to be, um, Beaker's friend? Well. Well, what are you doing, Deacon? <laughs> oh. What? Hey, buddy. Hello. How's it going, pal? Come here. Hey, buddy. Hello. Come here, buddy. Hi. Hello. All right, come here. Come here. Come. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god. All right, all right, all right. Fine. Have it your way. Okay. Hey. Huh, what? Wake up, Whoa. you lazy bastard. What's going on, man? What the hell is this? Shit. Oh, shit. Hey. Hey, how you doing, little guy? Hey, oh, easy, easy. <laughs> hey, hey, hold on. Hold on, huh? Where'd you come from? Don't look at me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, you look a little thirsty. Let's, uh, let's get you some water. How's that sound? What's his problem? What, is Beaker angry at me or something? What What the hell did I do? You asked me to piss in your cornflakes, it's not my fault my piss tastes like that. Damn it, Beaker. Oh my god. What the hell, that was also the cutest fucking Beak, puppy ever. I need you to meet me. I'm here, Schizo, what do you want? I'm busy. Look, I know you're trying to help the camp. I wonder about the first. I'm trying to help you help the camp. Right. Meet me at the back of the lodge. Skizzle out. I don't Damn trust it, you. Skizzle, this better be good. I don't buy it. I think something's gonna happen. I mean, if he wants us to meet him in the back something? of the lodge, hey, then the hell's my ratchet? I think he's go gonna yeah. kind of want to betray I'm Iron Mike. Okay. Yep. I'm thinking I'm that's what it is. Man. All right, fine. I guess I'll go talk to him. Hopefully, whatever it is, we can get it done in the next five minutes or so, but if not, oh well, I guess it's going to be one of those two-part episodes. Unless maybe I can get some uh, side missions once I step outside of camp? Possibly? I should check every now and then. All right, I'm here. What do you want? Hold on. Come on, in here. Excuse me, what's going on? Well, if you go inside, I'll show you. Hey, I've been thinking about your idea. You know the one where you want to seal the cave north of the camp to cut down on the hordes passing through our farm area? Okay. Problem is, Mike hasn't been able to find any deck cord for this, has he? No. But I know where you can get some. Right here. No way. <laughs> no, I know what you're no. thinking. I get it. No, that's okay. in the middle of Ripper territory. Last time I went through there, you got it didn't... meds that saved your boy's no. life. We get the debt cord, we blow the cave, boom, goodbye, oh. horde. Uh -huh. It was your goddamn idea. Look, they have sealed the goddamn border. They sealed the tunnel. If I go through there, I'm starting a war. I Excuse got me. a plan. Besides, I'm going with you. Keep your ass out of trouble. Just grab as much gear as you can. 
Hopefully we won't need it, but you never know. And then meet me here, because there's a trail that goes over Iron Ridge. What? Right there. What are you talking about? Just trust me. Jesus. Are you in? I'll see you there. I'm not buying it. Don't do it. I mean, we gotta do it, but I don't want to do it. <laughs> I don't trust this asshole. What? I thought for sure he was gonna jump me. I thought that's, that's what was gonna happen, legit. I was like, oh fuck, this is it. This is where we throw down with the schizo. Well, thankfully, that was enough to get me uh, carry that weight. Nice. Very nice. So what? Components, traps, and throwables. That means I can make uh, more of these things, yeah? Oh, hell yeah, baby. Double the amount? Oh, wow, wow, wee wa. Okay, uh, can't make... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, I need scrap? I don't got scrap? Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit, man. Alright, fine. Guess I'll go find some scrap elsewhere. Alright, so where does he want me to go? Uh, it's decently far. Alright, well, here's what I'm thinking. How about we head over there and then uh, we'll probably end the episode once we're in that region. Yeah, I think that might have to be the way it goes down today. Um, Ammunition-wise, I think I'm decent. I could top up on my pistol ammo, but I don't think it's super urgent that I get like six more bullets. Uh, no. Buzz Lightyear. Did you see me step through your shop? Did you see me make eye contact with you? Did I mention your phallus at any point today? Then I think you just answered your own question, Buzz Lightyear. Stop talking to me. My god. You even, like, exist in the same plane of, um, existence as one of these dudes and they're always fucking talking to you about shit. Yeah, I'll be there. Oh, it's all slippery and shit. <gasps> I see the prey. I must find it and kill it. Dink, this is Lost Lake. You out there? Yeah. Uh, hey, Ricky. I've been looking for you. Finally got power back on most of the camp, including my cabin. Mm. Yeah, what's up? What you want to uh, want me to visit your cabin? Great. Hey, I'm a. Uh... I even found an old water heater that works. Guess I'm gonna get my hot shower, yeah? Great, great. Hey, where are you? Look, uh, Schizo and I, we're, we're gonna get the debt cord for those explosives, you know, we're gonna seal the caves, remember? Yeah, but where? The only place around here with debt cord is... Uh, Ricky, hey, you're cutting out. I can't hear you, I'll talk to you. Just as soon as we get back. <laughs> Addy, you there? Yeah, Deacon, what's up? I, uh, I got Boozer the dog, and, and it worked, just like you said. <laughs> well, I'm glad. You know you're a good friend, or he's lucky to have you. Sure don't seem that way. Don't understand why Beaker's being such a little bitch. Come on, man, I got you a fucking puppy! You there? Yeah, booze man, what's up? I just... I just wanted to say thanks for the dog. It's no worries, brother. I mean, it, it followed me, you know? Wouldn't leave me alone, what was I supposed to do? Hey, hey, get down, hey. <laughs> yeah, sure it followed you. Hey, uh... Hey, Jack. <laughs> yeah, Jack would have loved that. Uh, no, he wouldn't have, which is why I did it. <laughs> all right, easy, easy, boy. All right, all right, enough, enough. Okay, Deke, I gotta go. Boozer out. You're welcome. Okay, you know what? That's the um, reaction I was looking for. All right, well, let's end the episode off here for now. We'll come back tomorrow, and I guess we'll go find the uh, dead cords in Ripper territory. Deke, this is Tucker. Or Stop not. By. 
got work for you. Great. Maybe Talk I'll do that instead. Okay. I'll see if I can make time peeking out. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, I guess I might as well do that before we go there, right? Because that seems to be the last encampment job uh, in the hot springs area, but we'll see. I mean, we're so close. We might as well do this and then do the um, hot springs one afterwards. Or whatever. We'll see. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast!